Hi, this is Sandy VSG, Sleeves VSG, sorry. Um, I just wanted to check in. I just had my six week um, checkup with the doctor. Uh, he said that everything is going well, that I'm doing exactly what I should be, and I'm right where I should be. I've lost 33 pounds, kind of at a plateau again. It seems like I go, go to a plateau, then I lose two pounds, and I plateau for a couple of days, and I lose two pounds, but I'm still losing, so. That's what I'm doing. Um, I actually just finished, and it reminded me that I needed to do a video. I just finished doing my meal planning. Um, I've been eating, and I don't know if you're familiar with these, but the Boar's Head um, deli meats, and then they also have cheeses. Um, but they're really good. That's what's recommended for our patients. Um, so they're good for, for bariatric patients, too. So I've been buying... Um, the ham and the smoked turkey and they have pastrami and they have roast beef um, and they have this really good cheese um, it starts with an H but it's dill pick or er, um, dill cheese and I think it would be really good to make chips with cheese chips instead of crackers that um, you could dip in like guacamole or hummus or something like that so I'm gonna try that. It, they were just so yummy. I have I've been eating them, just rolling up, um, you know, rolling up meat and putting cheese in it, and just rolling it up, and then I dip it in like mustard or Italian dressing um, for lunches. And I've kind of been doing that for dinner because I haven't shopped. I haven't had time to shop since I've been to um, my my surgeon and the dietitian. Um, I. I've got glowing colors on. I've been doing water aerobics. Um, I still kind of have problems with my foot because I broke it in December and it's still swelling and it's still sore um, after I exercise. And usually after a day of working, it's pretty swollen up and it throbs. So they kind of told me just to take it easy on the foot and do upper body and my water aerobics are great. And just to keep doing what I'm doing. So that's what I'm doing. I did join a gym just yesterday, Sunday. Um, today's Tuesday. So I did join a gym. I haven't been there yet. Um, I've been to the to aerobics. I go Monday, Wednesday, Saturday. So uh, maybe I can get to the gym in the next few days um, to just try to work out there. Otherwise, I just, you know, do stuff here, walk, lift weights, that kind of stuff, um, kind of low-impact stuff on my foot. Um, but my biggest challenge has been meal planning. I tend to get up in the morning and I'm rushed. So I either have a shake or, I know, we've had enough of them, right? Or I have um, a protein bar. And then I work, and I'm good until, and actually usually I don't even have that till like 10 o'clock because I'm up, I take my vitamins and all my pills and that kind of stuff, and I, I drink. And then I'm really not hungry until about 10 o'clock. So that's when I usually eat my protein bar or I'm out of milk, um, Fairlight milk, or I would have, I bought some protein filled, they're kind of like Cheerios or cereal. The bariatric clinic sells them. And so I found them online for a whole box and I ordered a couple boxes of those. So I would eat that in the morning too, um, just out of milk. But, um, it's the dinner time. I haven't had time to go to the store. I haven't had time to really prepare meals. So tonight I'm making a list of my grocery list and then also um, putting together my recipes. So recipes, the recipes are usually for like two to four, four um, batches. So I'm gonna show you because for how many meals did I plan? I've got one, two, three, four, five meals and a barbecue sauce. And let me see if I can switch this around. Oh, I guess I can't do it. I'll just turn it around. That's my grocery list. It's not that big. It's pretty short for all of those meals. Now I do have some of this stuff here, but it's very economical. And you know, like I make one meal and then it lasts for a while you know, maybe a week, and then I make another one. So that's kind of like my grocery list for about a month, I would think. Um, like I said, I do have, I have chicken here and um, a little bit of beef, no, venison actually. Um, but other than that, it, 
that's, you know, I have onions and normal garlic and that kind of stuff, normal stuff you have around the house. But that's a pretty good grocery list for a month's worth of, of groceries. So I've always heard that it's so expensive to eat the bariatric plan, but I really don't think it is. I've been using the bariatric eating um, website for the recipes, and they uh, supposedly have this chicken pizza that's to die for. You know I'm going to try it. Um, so I'm thinking maybe tomorrow night. I, may, I might even make it tonight or tomorrow night. I don't know. But that's that's what I'm doing. That's where I'm at. Um, everything is going good. I wish I'd lose more weight fast. Of course, I put it on one spoonful at a time. I have to take it off one spoonful at a time. Um, so I, I am noticing my clothes are bigger. And as, as, I out, or as they get too big, I just pull them out of my closet. Um, I've got a stack now. You can take 20 items to the consignment shop. So... I just pull them out, put them in a stack. You can take them on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Um, get them out of there. There's no reason to keep them. And I can earn credit towards new clothes or new used clothes while I'm going down sizes and not exactly where I need to be. So anyway, that's all I have for you today. I want to say good luck to Debbie Perkins, who goes into surgery Thursday. Have a great week.